I had zero expectations for this Olight iMini flashlight to be any good, as it's just 10 lumens, and while the tiniest thing I own, it didn't scream useful either. However, when you learn how it turns on, well bam, magnets. And given it's just about the size of the tip of my thumb, you'll really have no excuse not to take this with you. It's not the brightest or the widest light though, but for the odd jobs of finding something in the dark, or even as a work light, it surprisingly does a really good job at lighting up a small area. By no means is it ergonomic, but the textured ring does help when pinching it. However, it's the magnets that steal the show. When docked, it turns off auto magically, but don't worry, it ain't going anywhere either in my scientific shake test. Then, when you need to use it, simply pull and Alakazam. Plus, for how affordable this is, it's still built like a tank. And for context, this is the size you're dealing with. Perfect when combined with the metal ring, you can attach it beside your other tiny tools for quick access, with your keys as it blends right in, or to any loop on a bag so it's instantly accessible no matter where you are. Plus, that magnet not only works to turn it off, it makes for a hands-free experience wherever a magnet would stick onto as well. Great to highlight your idols, or used as an actual work light for your late-night hands-free activities. Now, we all know what a slob you are. That's why you need this, an OXO sweep and swipe laptop cleaner. This cute little package is like what a mop is to a floor or a dust buster to your high school trophies. It's got a retractable soft brush on one end, which feels like it's made of a teddy bear and covered on the opposite end, a microfiber cloth with sharp ends for those tricky corners. Now imagine this, you're working hard, your boss is virtually scolding you, so you decide to take a break. In comes your favorite snack, a pack of Malba toast. And bang bang, you've been there. I've been there, it happens to the best of us. Luckily, for the most part, it's still salvageable because it's your last pack. But those cute little crumbs is a no-go. That's where the sweep and swipe shines. Boom, zing, bungalow. When it's all clean, don't forget to pet it for being a good boy. And Alakazam, all the tiny crumbs be gone. But I'm also not a monster, I'm not gonna waste the rest of it. Don't forget about that weird habit we all do Admit it, you've done it too. Not a problem for this block of cheese though, and yes, it's also great for any of your other devices as well. Everything packs away when done, keeping it fresh for your next snack in about an hour or so. Plus, you will find yourself brushing this along your skin because it really is as soft as a baby fox. This next one is probably one of my favorite new accessories I recently discovered, the Clear Look. Phone mount is a two-in-one combo, which is a steal for how affordable it is while being built like a premium one. Basically, it consists of a 360 degree rotating and swivel head in the middle with a clamp on both ends of it. The flat end designed to clamp onto a surface and the other for your phone. The surface clamp is made of metal with some rubber feet, which is surprisingly sturdy for its price. And the other end is a standard spring-loaded phone mount that does the trick. Rotate, twist, and position your phone at almost any angle you can imagine, then just slap it onto your table. The table spring holds the whole setup very securely in place, while the phone, although a little bouncy, it can handle a serious shakedown as well. Plus, you can even twist it into a portrait mode for a easy tabletop angle too. Of course, the mounting possibilities are endless. You can attach it onto your armrest to have your phone always by your side, or onto some shelves to Netflix and chill while doing the dishes. No judgment here. Better yet, it makes a perfect top-down shot for some super boring dishwashing vlog footage that no one wants to watch. Then when you're done, everything folds into a compact packed little chocolate bar that fits in the palm of your hands that's actually durable enough you can trust to just throw in your bag. Now it isn't over yet. I did say it was a two-in-one and if you invert the whole thing, it also doubles as a foam stand on top of a table and not just any regular stand either. This one can pretty much adjust to any angle as well. It's essentially a foam mount for, well, anywhere. If you never seem to have the right cable on you, then the Booty 9-in-1 adapter is the only stick of gum you'll need to remember to take with you. Not only does opening and closing it make you feel like a total spy, its metal casing is totally something James Bond would actually use too. Minimal branding, all black design, and this sick pullout method is just an added bonus. Slots for micro SD cards on the inside, adapter heads for every type of plug, and a whole USB-C cable tucked in there too. However, if you plug the cable in the adapter itself, slide one of the micro SD cards in, and plug that bad boy in, it's also a micro SD card reader as well. What can't this do? Well, maybe not save the world, but it may save your butt trying to hand in the assignment right before a deadline. Better yet, not having to carry another long cable in your pockets for every single device is worth it alone. Plus, there's a hidden SIM card ejector too, 
because why not at this point? Everything neatly tucks back into its dedicated slot and you can toss this into your bag without having to worry you may have forgotten something. Unfortunately, you'll probably still forget your keys anyways. Moving to the opposite side, hidden within the zippered compartment is literally the only cable Bond needs to charge and access any of his devices. The new Rolling Square InCharge X can handle up to 100 watts, making it probably the fastest and tiniest charging cable available. The real benefit though is in the multiple cable options. Built into this tiny case with a USB-A, USB-C, Lightning, and micro USB plugs available. You can quickly transfer or charge to the USB-C plugs, support older devices with USB-A, and still be completely compatible with any Apple device requiring a Lightning port too. My favorite use case going to the ability to charge my iPhone directly from my iPad as a backup while on the go. No more dealing with long and tangled wires, just this tiny yet sturdy metal bodied one with, might I add, a thick AF cable, making it the one cable you will not be able to break. Especially when combined with the tough casing, it's just amazing how over-engineered this is, and yet so very appreciated that it is too. When done, it magnetically attaches to itself, creating a loop to make for easy storage and even fitting comfortably on your keychain to have ready with you at all times. So what would you prefer? having to carry all these cables with you or having it conveniently packed into this little device. Seriously, as it's just about the size of a Haichu when packed away. Although one is definitely tastier than the other. Now for all you keyboard warriors who find themselves running out of ways to troll, you tend to look around trying to find ways to keep your fingers busy. That's where a fidget tool like this Fidget House Infinity Cube comes in handy. Get it? Because fingers. <clears throat> it's sort of like if a Rubik's Cube made love to a fidget spinner. You'd get this folding piece of metal that simply goes from being a flat bar to a symmetrical square over and over again. Which is relaxing as you feel like you've accomplished something with every loop and you may or may not have just lost an hour of your day. Now this one is made of a zirconia metal and yes it does cost as much as it weighs but it does feel like a weighted blanket for your hands. However there are plenty of affordable options too like this one made of plastic and in varying sizes as well. Thankfully, no matter which one you go with, they'll all give you the same calming and internal rage feeling all at the same time. On the bright side, it's something you can fiddle with silently and not annoy everyone else around you. They did a survey and 93% of the population hates key rings. Don't fact check me on that, but I hate it. You hate it. But of course, Gary, your coworker loves them, but who cares? Because I've lost one too many nails to this battle. So when OrbitKey updated their ring clips, I said take my money no matter how much it costs. As it solves a problem we can all relate to, plus it comes in matte black. Win-win. Essentially, it's a key ring, but 2.0. Because it utilizes one metal ring with a lock mechanism you simply pull to unlock. So empty your old one one last time, then drop whatever you need in, and we'll bam Lock back in place, no broken nails, and spilt coffee from raging. And trust me when I say, it's just as secure. It ain't going anywhere. The best part, adding and removing keys are just as fast, with plenty of room to cosplay a janitor and carry all the keys. Plus, if you're worried about it breaking and losing all your keys, don't worry, it could probably carry more than you can. Do you even lift, bro? Everyone, and I mean everyone, needs this if they like snacks. Because who hasn't done this before? As Cheetos is your keyboard's arch nemesis. Thankfully, there's the snack div. In summary, a rubbery pair of chopsticks that stay between your fingers and like actual chopsticks can hold your food for you. So you can get back to raging at Brenda without dusting your keyboard with secret sauce every time. You don't even need to know how to use chopsticks. They've basically made it foolproof and pretty indestructible too. There's additional grip on the tips, a soft handle to wear comfortably for long periods, but still sturdy and strong enough enough to lift and maneuver heavier snacks too. After you're done and washed up, they include a carrying case to keep it clean for when the next craving hits. But it's also nice to know I can toss it into my bag and have it with me like a secret weapon. Next up, global crisis or not, I hate touching public doorknobs. So having the gel clip hand sanitizer bottle conveniently clipped onto my pants means I can confidently open doors for my crush and hope that she actually notices me one day. Seriously, this one can shoot a solid load with a single pump, something we're all too familiar with. And sure, it's basically a tiny squeeze bottle, but they've geniusly made it so that no matter how little sanitizer is left, you're getting every last drop. Plus, the tiny size makes it easy to share and make some new friends the old-fashioned way with eye contact. Honestly speaking, the one-handed action is worth it alone. Cha-ching. If you already carry a lighter with you, 
this is a no-brainer. Keeping my fingers busy is the Flicker lighter case. Don't worry, it doesn't block or stop you from being a pyromaniac, but it does add this knob. A free spinning axle smack dab in the middle. So not only does it align perfectly to spin around, it's also designed to fit the very popular Bic lighter design, which can be had for a low low price of free when you borrow it from a friend and never return it. Although plastic, it's thick enough that it doesn't feel cheap whatsoever, and they do come in different designs, but blackout every Everything is a vibe. The lighter is friction fit and also clipped in place, so it isn't going anywhere. Important, as you'll be doing this all day. And the last thing you want is to drop this lighter beside your friend, as they will say that it's theirs. 